The government press is situated along Nairobi's Hail Selassie Avenue. It borders Kenya Polytechnic. And prominently displayed at the entrance is a board with a warning that the government press is a corrupt free zone. The government press provides printing services at a cost not only to government departments but also the private sector and the general public. The institution is called the government press and its head is known as the government printer. That position is currently held by Andrew Rukaria, who is answerable to the Permanent Secretary, Provincial Administration and Internal Security under the office of the President. Rukaria is a former district officer. We visited a private printer, Kish Graphics, in the city to acquaint ourselves with what happens inside a press. First, the client brings what is called artwork for printing, which may be in hard copy or soft copy. You don't take chances. You have to double check on your job. If it is wrong, you talk to the printer. He corrects it before he prints it. Some bring a copy that is ready to undergo the printing process. You make sure that he signs it, he puts the date, and then you pick up the artwork. You go and shoot the artwork. We are still on print origination. You go and shoot the artwork with our cameras and that is where we get the films which we put on the plate. Now, this is a sample of a blank plate. It's on this plate where the artwork from the client will be imposed, and from here it will be printed. At this stage, the client is not involved. The client is not in the dark room. The client is waiting for the finished work. This is a sample film that has been reproduced from an artwork using a camera that is operated in a dark room. Several films may be made depending on the number of pages of the original work. This is the dark room where the film is burnt onto the plate. On my left is a film and on my right is the identical plate produced from the film. The next step is printing. This is a plate being inserted into the printer and this is the final stage. The product being the exact reproduction of the metallic plate. Okay, the artwork you signed and the plate, if they're the same, there's no mistake. The job continues. The job has to continue. But if you, uh, you delivered a wrong thing, the client will come back with his artwork and they double check on the plate. And he says this plate is different from my artwork. It means if it is provable that a wrong artwork or plate was introduced at the printing stage, the printer should take responsibility. And if the artwork brought by the client is the exact content on the plate and the final product, then it is the mistake of the client. Alex Chamada, Citizen TV.